to do and what he likes to try to do is try to catch Dr. York up in contradictions. And he may have said this one time and said this. Human beings are subject to error. He even said it himself. All human beings are subject to error. But when you get into the principles of what Nuwapu is about and what Nuwapu is, let me show you a real source. Hold on. Let me show you a real source real quick. Let me share my screen real quick to give the actual facts on what exactly it is. What do the Nuwap do the Nuwapians believe is belief a part of their teachings, etc. Let's let, let's talk about that. This is right knowledge theories number one. What is Nuwapu book? Basic, simple uh, 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 guideline book. This is from Scrib.com. You can read majority of Dr. York's uh, publications on Scrib.com. It's called What is Nuwapu? Right Knowledge Series number one. This is the basic. If anybody wants to know, not getting third party information from Chuck Morgan, disgruntled ex-members, people who are being persuaded <laughs> to come out and tell lies against uh, black leaders and attack black leaders, present pseudo information, uh, fault. He's a pseudo Sumerian scholar. Asan Hotep debunked the heck out of him and his Everybody pseudo did. information yeah, of the yeah, Sumerian yeah. text. He has no qualifications. Nonsense. But, Nonsense. Let, but let me finish right here. What is Nuwapu, right? You can, everybody can find this book. This is very clear, very clear. Clear cut. All right. What is Nuwapu? What is a Nuwapian? Now, as far as the um, mentions of Christianity and stuff like that, in the beginning of all of Dr. York's publications, all you have to do is read. Read the man's work. Don't believe what somebody else said about him. Read his work. He explains the different degrees, schools of thoughts that he went through. Um, and, and so that would explain the different stances or the different positions he would take while wearing these veils or these cloaks while teaching these different degrees. Everybody know that the uh, master teacher Dr. Malachi York is a master mason, been through the Masonic degrees, and in those degrees is a part of the infrastructure of the way Dr. York taught and went into all the other teachings. So he explains by all the teachings that he went through under Islam, more science, nation of Islam, Hebrew, Christianity, and the Final degrees, which is the ancient Egyptian order and the degrees that we in now with Uluwa, right? So that explains the difference in the teaching methodologies from different schools. You have to go through the degrees in order in order to get a full understanding. Now, in the beginning of this book, he makes it very clear in the author's note. That means he wants you to know what he's saying here. He says, I'm not a holy man or a preacher. I'm just a master teacher. And at the bottom, at the very end, he always says, you have found your way to that which you have sought all your life. Don't believe a word I say. Check it out for yourself. Now, we're going to read right here real quick that the term that the uh, the principles of this science or this teaching of Nuwapo itself is anti-belief. OK, what is Nuwapo? Nuwapo is the science of sound right reasoning and as follows are the sons and daughters of sound right reasoning. Belief is ignorance. Belief is to ignore the facts intentionally or ignorantly. Nuwapu is right knowledge, right wisdom, and right understanding. If one has to believe, it means he or she does not know. And if one does not know, that is ignorance. Hence, belief is ignorance and religious beliefs without facts is ignorance. You see? So that right there, like I said, for every, for every point that Chuck Morgan tries, weak point that Chuck Morgan tries to bring here, I will rebut him point for point. We can do this all night. We can go to the sunrise and stop. Never. We can go. Mm. You know mm. I got the information for him. That's why he's been running. But I'm mm. bad. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Let's let Chuck respond to that. <laughs>